A silver cigarette case. Looks like it's been through a war, which is likely. How long were you in that cell? Long enough to learn that Constantine won't stop until he's found what he's looking for. The Divine Source. Is it here? <laughs> Trust must go both ways, Lara. What is this? A history lesson. This place has its own scars. It was a work camp. The Soviets sent prisoners here. To work in the mines. Even that wasn't enough. They captured us. Took children from their mothers to work as slaves. God. It must have been horrible. Anyone who survived those days has stories to tell. I finally laid my betrayals bare. Lara knows the truth. Now a strange series of emotions has gripped me. Remorse, certainly. Remorse for a piece of me that was left inside that torture cell. But something else, too. I know Constantine thinks that I've lost my edge, that my time with the Crofts has made me soft, but he's wrong. It isn't softness. It feels instead like a new kind of resolve. I knew Lord Croft to be an intelligent man. I know his daughter holds secrets in her head. As an ally, she'd be invaluable. As an enemy, she'll be a difficult problem. I must make sure that Constantine's arrogance doesn't get the better of him as we take her on. That doesn't look like mining. It looks like an excavation. It's, uh, possible. They dug anywhere they caught a hint of wealth. Those... those are ancient. What did they find? You'll have to ask them. We have to go. We aren't safe here. My village is in the valley on the other side of the mountain. We'll be safe there. Command post 2, last chopper outbound. Roger. That'll be the last ship. Reports of trouble at the communications depot. More natives. Next, we caught an armed intruder from the outside. Some woman. She stirred up trouble on the perimeter. Are we expecting others? Possibly. After the initial attack, we stepped up the patrol. sets in.
Under fire! Jacob, I found a way to open the inner gate. Head to the courtyard. I'm already inside. I need to get in there. A few sharpshooters and scouts. We have a lot of ground to cover. Trinity wants the artifact found as soon as possible. We aren't getting anything on satellite. Jacob, what is he doing? This is the place. Shit. Be careful, Lara. Quite convincing. I want to get into those ruins myself. And Croft. We keep her alive. wait to leave this frozen hell. Then I have good news. Reconnaissance from the scouts. The natives have a settlement on the other side of the mountain. Soon, you will have your day. We both will. Just as long as you don't lose focus again. What do you mean? You're sentimental about her. The Croft girl, I can tell because she's still alive. We can't afford to dwell in the past. You doubt me? You know what I've given to Trinity. What I've sacrificed. What I face. <coughs> I'm fine. Life has not been kind to either of us. But I swore I'd always protect you. Now who's being sentimental? I promise you. All of this will be worth it in the end. With the Divine Source, you will live. But more importantly, you will live in a world cleansed of sin. Send your men to this settlement. Find out what they know. It's too dangerous.
Let me have my pleasures. None of this will matter. The day our work is accomplished. Constantine, you're needed in the holding cells. We're in this together, sister. Remember. Always. What are you doing? Mankind shall be judged, the non-believers turned to ash and swept away, and the pure of faith will be raised up and given life eternal. Get out! I'll find you! We've got to find them! Keep looking! They have to be here somewhere. Prison floor is clear. Eyes open. He has to still be here. On All right. Got to find a way out of here. being in the field again. I was undercover for so long, locked in a life of comfort at Croft Manor. Here, there is no comfort at all. The air is frozen, the food is canned and cold. The company, aside from Constantine, is abysmal. But I asked to be here. I need to be here. I do not have the luxury of time or patience. Constantine and I begin this journey together. I will be there when he fulfills his destiny. So for now, I'll breathe deep. I'll let the cold air burn my lungs. I'll let it remind me that I'm still alive. And let it fuel me for the final push towards our destiny. A military patch for Trinity soldiers. Aside from the design, there's no identifying techs. They keep themselves hidden, even from their own foot soldiers.
As we push deeper into the valley, I find myself staring at the ruins and pondering my own mortality. These structures have been here for ages, waiting for this moment. I can feel their anticipation. The stone itself wants us to succeed. And what is there to stop us? Non-believers, the fearful, and the lost. Those that hid the source from Trinity for so long. We are the very people who would use what's hidden here, as it was intended to be used. This world is too corrupt, too rotten, too sick to be saved by any means other than Trinity. We will have our army. A righteous man will lead it. Constantine will be that man. Things are becoming clear. I know. There's something hidden here. The Soviets came looking for it too. And now Trinity and Anna. Anna. God. I still don't quite believe it. All this time. Did she watch Dad as well? I've got to keep moving. Find Jacob and join his people. If I can prove myself to them, maybe he will tell me more about this place.
Moving into position. He's gone. Keep her down. Hostile spotted. She's alone. Move out. And make it quick. You hear that? I'll go look. As we push deeper into the valley, I feel reassured that this is the work I was chosen to perform. My stigmata itch with sensation. It is a constant reminder of my higher purpose, of my singular position in this higher purpose. I was a child, innocent to the evils of the world. Then, one night, I woke in such pain, a scream on my lips. Blood dripped from my palms when I saw it. I was terrified. It marked me. It meant something. I cannot shirk this mission any more than I can shirk my own hands. Jacob? I think I'm close to the train yard. Are you there? A badge of rank in a military order. Trinity. Another Soviet plaque. 
Enemies must answer for their crimes. Hm, bit grim. Took you so long. I thought I lost you back there. Not a chance. Thanks for getting me out of that place. Let's move! We can get up through there! thought about it <laughs> <laughs> what makes you think I didn't <sighs> so what makes you risk so much to come here the divine source I know what you're looking for But I want to know why. When I was young, it was just my father and I. He was an archaeologist too. In his last years, he was... obsessed 
with myths about immortality. Of course, no one believed him, including me. Our last conversation was a fight. He... He took his own life. I thought I'd come to terms with it, but... Something else happened. And I saw something that I thought was impossible. It changed everything. I realized my father was right. He died alone and broken. But he died for something. So you believe the divine source is real? I honestly don't know. But if there is any truth to it, I have to find out. It, it needs to be researched and studied. It could make a difference to the world. It's not something to be hidden away. A difference is not always for the best. Would you wish Trinity to have the secret to immortality? Of course not. Then I would ask you not to abandon your quest, but to alter its path. Join me and my people. Help us repel Constantine and Trinity. Then after that's done. And you leave our valley untouched. But knowing that you've done the right thing. No. I'm sorry. I can't do that. Can't. Or won't. I'll fight Trinity with you, but my goal remains the same. If I give up now... You'd feel like you'd be letting him down. Not just him. I need answers, Jacob. I need to understand. You're leaving. Right now, my concern is for my village. It's over the mountain pass. A day's journey on foot. But there may be a faster way through the old copper mine. You rest. I'll be back soon.